Hello everyone, I'm Alan, also known as McLaren2009, and today I'm going to be playing Stormworks. I recently uploaded a radar system onto the Steam Workshop, but I've been having a, I've been getting a lot of questions from people asking me how to use it and how to actually set it up. So now I'm going to walk you through the entire process from start to finish. It's really, really simple to use it, but there seem to be some kind of issues with just getting it to work. So, for starters, we have a just plain, well, flat set of blocks, a velocity pivot, battery, Oh, then we need some way to act to actually we need a place to actually put the monitor all right turn off that remove that remove that okay now for the system itself we're going to need an instrument panel Get that pointing the right way. Go into the instrument panel. Don't need anything there. This is going to be an indicator saying target found. That'll be blank. And this is going to be a flip switch. Set to channel 4. Call this radar power. It's not really important, but you get the idea. Okay, now we need a 2x2 two two monitor. Pointing up. This part is actually kind of important, because which way is considered up is going to be relevant to which way the radar faces. Okay, so raise this up a couple of blocks. We're going to get a radar. Alright, pointing forward and rotating clockwise. Those are kind of important, or at least to make sure that they're spinning the same way. Okay, now I have my actual radar controller. That's this block right here. And this is all of the things you're going to need. So, now we go into electricity. We have our power supply here. Connect that to that. Connect that to that. Okay, now everything has electricity. Composite. Here. Here. Not that one. Video, here to here. Now, as far as data goes, okay, target found goes to the target found, target distance goes to distance, rotation angle goes to rotation angle here. These down here are pretty important the rotation setting, this actually goes to the velocity pivot that tells it to rotate in general, and this is field of view. So put that up into the field of view sec field of view port on the radar itself. Now, just to make sure, this is the power for the monitor, and also it can be the backlight for that, but it's not really going to matter in the grand scheme of things because there's nothing here that requires a backlight. So, just to make sure, no problems. All of the nodes are connected. Number, power, composite, and video. They're all connected to electricity. Let's spawn this in.
Now, as you can see, I'm currently the only thing being detected. So, let's go over here and let's spawn something else in. We have my pre-made radar test set that I actually have the pictures of on the workshop. So, just so we have an object over there, let's flip the switch back on and see what it does. Alright, so, there is me. Now when it comes back around, there's the other test set. So, that is how you build and set up the radar detection system. Thank you for your time.